renewing your mind with the promises of God. As you meditate on these songs, may you find your spirit uplifted and your heart drawn closer to the divine. Seeking solace in God's embrace, as we turn to the Psalms, we found a sanctuary of comfort and hope. These blessed verses offer a gentle reminder of God's closeness in times of distress, beckoning us to find peace and solace in His in eternal embrace. Psalms 102, verse 1 and 2. Hear my prayer, O Lord, and let my cry come to you. Do not hide your face from me in the day of my trouble. Incline your ear to me in the day that I call. Answer me. Verse 1 and 2. Hear my prayer, O Lord, and let my cry come to you. Do not hide your face from me in the day of my trouble. Incline your ear to me in the day that I call. Answer me speedily. Psalms. 102, verse 1 and 2. Hear my prayer, O Lord, and let my cry come to you. Do not hide your face from me in the day of my trouble. Incline your ear to me in the day that I call. Psalms 102, verse 15 through 17. So the nations shall fear the name of the Lord, and all the kings of the earth your glory. For the Lord shall build up Zion, he shall appear in his glory. He shall regard the prayer of the destitute, and shall not despise. Psalms 102, verse 15 through 17. So the nations shall fear the name of the Lord, and all the kings of the earth your glory. For the Lord shall build up Zion. He shall appear in his glory. He shall regard the prayer of the destitute, and shall not despise their prayer. Psalms 102, verse 15 through 17. So the nations shall fear the name of the Lord, and all the kings of the earth your glory. For the Lord shall build up Zion. He shall appear in his glory. He shall regard the prayer of the destitute, and shall not despise their prayer. Psalms 103, verse 11 through 13. For as the heavens are high above the earth, so great is his mercy towards those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, so far as he removed our transgressions from us. As a father pities his children, so the Lord pities those who fear him. Psalms 103, verse 11 through 13. For as the heavens are high above the earth, so great is his mercy towards those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, so far as he removed our transgressions, 
as a father pities his children, so the Lord pities those who fear him. Psalms 103, verse 11 through 13. For as the heavens are high above the earth, so great is his mercy towards those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, so far as he removed our transgressions from us. As a father pities his children, so the Lord pities those who fear him. Psalms 103, 17, 13. But the mercy of the Lord is from everlasting to everlasting on those who fear him. And his righteousness to children's children, to such as keep his covenant, and to those who remember his commandments to do them. Psalms 103, 17 through 18. But the mercy of the Lord is from everlasting to everlasting on those who fear him and his righteousness to children's children, to such as keep his covenant and to those who remember his commandments to do them. Psalms 103, 17 through 18. But the mercy of the Lord is from everlasting to everlasting on those who fear him and his righteousness to children's children, to such as keep his covenant and to those who remember his commandments to do them. Psalms 104 verse 1. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, O oh Lord my God. You are very great. You are clothed with honor and majesty. Psalms 104, verse 1. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, O oh Lord my God. You are very great. You are clothed with honor and majesty. Psalms 104, verse 1. Bless the Lord, O my soul. O Lord, my God. You are very great. You are clothed with honor and majesty. Psalms. 104, verse 27 and 28. These all wait for you, that you may give their food in due season. What you give them, they gather in. You open your hand, and they are filled with good. Psalms 104, Verse 27 and 28. These all wait for you, that you may give their food in due season. What you give them, they gather in. You open your hand, and they are filled with good. Psalms 104, verse 27 and 28. These all wait for you, that you may give their food in due season. What you give them, they gather in. You open your hand, and they are filled with good. Psalms 105, verse 7 and 8. He is the Lord, our God. His judgment are in all the earth. He remembers his covenant forever, the word which he commanded for a thousand generations. Amen. Psalms 105, 
verse 7 and 8. He is the Lord, our God. His judgment are in all the earth. He remembers his covenant forever. The word which he commanded for a thousand generations. Amen. Psalms 105, verse 7 and 8. He is the Lord, our God. His judgment are in all the earth. He remembers his covenant forever. The word which he commanded for a thousand generations. Amen. Psalms, verse 115, verse 14 and 15. May the Lord give you increase more and more, you and your children. May you be blessed by the Lord who made the heaven and the earth. Psalms, verse 115, verse 14 and 15. May the Lord give you increase more and more, you and your children. May you be blessed by the Lord who made the heaven and the earth. Psalms, verse 115, verse 14 and 15. May the Lord give you increase more and more, you and your children. May you be blessed by the Lord who made the heaven and the earth. Psalms 116, verse 1 and 2. I love the Lord because he has heard my voice, my supplication. Because he has inclined his ear to me. Therefore, I will call upon him as long as I live. Psalms 116, verse 1 and 2. I love the Lord because he has heard my voice, my supplication, because he has inclined his ear to me. Therefore, I will call upon him as long as I live. Psalms 116 verse 1 and 2. I love the Lord because he has heard my voice, my supplication, because he has inclined his ear to me. Therefore, I will call upon him as long as I live. Psalms 118 and 1. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endures forever. Psalms 118 and 1. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endures forever. Psalms 118 and 1. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endures forever. Verse 5 and 6. I call on the Lord in distress. The Lord answered me and set me in a broad place. The Lord is on my side. I will not fear. What can man do to me? Psalms. 118 and 14. The Lord is my strength and song, and he has become my salvation. Psalms 118, verse 5 and 6. 
I call on the Lord in distress. The Lord answered me and set me in a broad place. The Lord is on my side. I will not fear. What can man do to me? Psalms. The Lord is my strength and song, and he has become my salvation. Psalms 118, verse 5 and 6. I call on the Lord in distress. The Lord answered me and set me in a broad place. The Lord is on my side. I will not fear. What can man do to me? Psalms 118 and 14. The Lord is my strength and song, and he has become my salvation. Psalms 118, verse 27 and 28. God is the Lord, and he has given us light. Bind the sacrifice with cords to the horn of the hold. You are my God, and I will praise you. You are my God, and I will exalt you. Psalms 119. Verse 1 and 2. Blessed are the undefiled of the way, who walk in the law of the Lord. Blessed are those who keep his testimonies, who seek him with the whole heart. Psalms 118, verse 27 and 28. God is the Lord, and he has given us light. Bind the sacrifice with cords to the horn of the Lord. You are my God, and I will praise you. You are my God, and I will exalt you. Psalms 119, verse 1 and 2. Blessed are the undefiled of the way, who walk in the law of the Lord. Blessed are those who keep his testimonies, who seek him with the whole heart. Psalms 118, verse 27 and 28. God is the Lord, and he has given us light. Bind the sacrifice with cords to the horn of the hope. You are my God, and I will praise you. You are my God, and I will exalt you. Psalms 119, verse 1 and 2. Blessed are the undefiled of the way, who walk in the law of the Lord. Blessed are those who keep his testimonies, who seek him with the whole heart. Psalms 119, verse 9 and 11. How can a young man cleanse his way? By taking heed according to your word. With my whole heart I have sought you. Oh, let me not wander from your commandments. Your word I have hid in my heart that I might not sin against you. Oh, Lord. Psalms 119, verse 9 through 11. How can a young man cleanse his way? By taking heed according to your word. With my whole heart I have sought you. Oh, let me not wander from your commandments. Your word I have hidden in my heart that I might not sin against you, O oh Lord. Psalms 119, verse 9 through 11. How can a young man cleanse his way? By taking heed according to your word. 
with my own heart I have sought you. Oh, let me not wander from your commandment. Your word I have hid in my heart that I might not sin against you. Oh, Lord. that I may live and keep your word. Open my eyes that I may see the wondrous things from your love. Psalms 119 and 30. I have chosen the way of truth. Your judgment I have laid before me. with your servant that I may live and keep your word. Open my eyes that I may see the wondrous things from your mouth. Psalms 119 and 30 I have chosen the way of truth. Your judgment and 18. Be a bountiful with your servant that I may live and keep your word. Open my eyes that I may see the wondrous things from your law. Psalms 119 and 30. I have chosen the way of truth. Your judgment I have laid before me. Amen. Psalms 119, verse 37, 38. Turn away my eyes from looking at worthless things and revive me in your way. Establish your way. Establish your will to your soul who is devoted. 